Hi everyone, Rini here and welcome to my channel. So today we're going to talk about Bomb Crypto or Bcoin. I think it was recently launched just over a couple of weeks ago and it has been rallying ever since. So let's take a look at its price action to see um, what potential opportunities are out there, okay? So the tricky part about new cryptos is it still needs to start forming a personality, so to speak, in terms of how it's traded. Because it's so new, it's very hard to see really what's going on. And we don't have moving averages to help guide us. Even the RSI and the stock RSI are still all, all over the place. Because as price keeps moving, we need more time in order to develop all of the metrics that we need to have. So what I'd like to do is over a short time frame, like a daily, if we don't have any indicators yet, then just move to a lower time frame, like the four hour, and you start to see what's going on. Now, Bitcoin has started to really rise up um, and do its price action. For those of you who have bought Bitcoin early, then congratulations. We still have a lot of legs to move um, upwards. But if you're somebody who's looking to go into Bitcoin, just be careful for now. So it's currently at a run-up that has already resulted in a 430% increase. So you don't want to FOMO in here yet until we see what price structures are currently happening. So right now for Bitcoin on a 4 hourly time frame, as you can see, we were sort of overextended from the 21 EMA right here, but has since attempted to break structure multiple times now. So in this case, we held the 55, which is good. We held the 55 again. But one thing to note is we have started to slow down. We have also started to form an ascending triangle right here. Now, if you're looking to get into Bitcoin, you may have to wait a little bit because there are two scenarios that may happen on an ascending triangle. This is typically a bullish structure, but only if price breaks out of this resistance level and backtest it as support before continuation to the upside. If that happens, we do have a technical target of around $5.18. That's the bullish case. So if you're looking for a buying opportunity, one scenario is wait for this resistance line to be broken and this would be your buying opportunity, not financial advice. Just because you have an ascending triangle, it doesn't mean that it's always gonna go to the upside. You may have a breakdown of structure right here and go on the downside. If that happens, so let's say you break down somewhere in the future around here, then what's gonna happen is you're gonna start breaking down and go all the way back to $2.16. If this happens, just be careful because just because we have a technical target of $2.16, it doesn't mean that one, it will just immediately shoot up to $2.16. That's not how it works. The way it's going to work is, of course, it will break structure, rally, then go down a bit, rally, go down, go down, go down until it meets it. The second thing that you have to note is if this technical target is met on the downside, it doesn't mean that this is the bottom. That's the challenge with bearish trends. We don't know where the bottom will be. Instead, when it happens, if we break down from here and start to form our downward structures, then we will see what structures are forming and we will base our analysis on when the trend breaks rather than trying to find the bottom. Because as they say, if you pick bottoms, you get smelly fingers. And that's it. Just a quick video on uh, Bitcoin. A general advice for those of you who are new to the crypto space, please do not FOMO in projects when they are mooning like this. Because again, over the past couple of weeks, this project has already gained 400%. If you ape in and if you FOMO in, you will be left holding the bags of those who are willing to sell now at this price to realize their profits 
and move on to other projects while you will be stuck waiting for this project to continue to move. It also doesn't help that when you search for this token on YouTube, all you're going to see is this is the next 50x, this is the next 100x, this is the next 10x. And it's honestly very frustrating to see this because again, all of these claims are unsubstantiated. All of these claims do not conform to what the data says. So just be careful, okay? And that's it. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Also, let me know what you think in the comments below. If you also have other gaming cryptos that you would like me to look at, just leave it down in the comments below and I'll look at it. Until then, that's all for me. Bye-bye.